What's up guys? Let's go through an oil change. All dirty. No bueno. Go ahead and turn your mower on. Get that oil nice and hot. Uh, it falls out of the engine much easier. Alright. I like to use an old garden hose here to get some extension. It just keeps everything nice and clean. Keeps oil from spilling out. We're always going to double check our funnels and clean our funnels. I don't want to be pouring sand on your engine, of course, so make sure those funnels are completely clean. Very important. Alright, here's what we're going to do uh, with this nut. Don't put it on your deck. Don't put it on the ground. Put it in your pocket or you'll lose it. Okay, put it right in your pocket. And then go ahead and hook up that garden hose. Look at this. It just kind of gives you some more room to play with. It just keeps everything nice and clean. Alright, open the... Uh, oil receptacle it lets it drain a lot better another little trick is you can raise the side of your mower up a little bit lean it towards the way it's falling out it just gets that last little bit out of there i feel like anyway it drains a lot better to me 20w50 is what you need anything south of the mason dixon that's what my dealer says heat index 110 115 oil is super thick um, so that's what we want to keep in our engines. Look at this air filter, man. It's horrible. Don't be trying to pat it out. Use the air hose and spray it out. Throw that thing away. Put a new one in every single time you do maintenance. Every time we do an oil change, we're doing an oil filter. We're doing an air filter, all right? It's too cheap. And an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of repairs. All right? There's that oil filter. What we're going to do here we're going to wet the uh, paper element and we're going to wet the rubber ring around it so you get a nice seal whenever you reattach it. So again, we're not completely filling it up. We are just wetting those elements inside the oil filter before we reattach it. Get in there nice and snug. We're going to double check that our funnel is clean. Can't stress that enough. Double, triple, quadruple check that your funnel is clean. right there is the second quart going in nice and clean look at that you guys stay up to date on your maintenance these machines are expensive and again an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of repairs